Hi everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember, you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today, guys, going to take a look at just a stunning 1970 Buick GS factory 455 car. Killer car, guys. Beautiful paint. This car is actually finished in atomic orange, which is a Corvette color. Uh, it's got the factory black vinyl interior. You can see it's got the 15-inch uh, Buick rallies with BF Goodrich radio TAs all the way around it. And I'm telling you, this color just jumps off this car. I wish we had sun. Unfortunately, we got rain and more rain coming. I'm leaving in the morning. I know guys have already asked about pics and video on this car. So I'm going to get this thing posted uh, today so that uh, you're not waiting around to see it. Um, but great car, man. Again, original 455 car. It is supposed to be the matching numbers engine. You, um, I, well, I'll, I'll show you when we get to the engine compartment. I can't verify that. Uh, but pretty, pretty car, man. Again, gorgeous paint. Uh, car runs and drives excellent. I actually bought it locally here. You can nitpick uh, a little bit of those bezels, but pretty doggone nice. Not a whole lot to really pick at on this car. car was actually restored around 2011. There is the receipts, uh, some receipts on the restoration. Um, a Ram Air hood car. Oops, sorry, that's just a... But just gorgeous paint, man. This thing in the sunshine looks like it's on fire, guys. That's just my guy's Mark showing me that it's ready. Dash is nice. Slick, slick paint. And like you say, just a beautiful color. Great car. Like I said, good, solid, straight body. I love these cars. Very underappreciated cars. That bumper's nice. But, uh, Sorry guys, they're just nice and straight down the sides. Got good size meats on both on the rear and on the front. Car's got a real good sound to it. Nice and clean underneath. I took some pictures of the bottom. We'll get those posted. Pretty, pretty car. Front disc brakes. Again, you can break it down through the VIN. This is definitely a factory 455 car. It's supposed to be a matching numbers car. Sometimes you can see the VIN right between those heads, but unfortunately you can't, so I can't verify that. Again, I can tell by the VIN, it is a factory correct 455 car. Stock four barrel, stock intake, it's got a real nice set of ceramic Doug's headers on it. Power steering, power front disc brakes. Again, factory Ram Air hood car. Uh, factory Air, Air Works, blows ice cold. Uh, 400 turbo hydromatic trans. Stock air cleaner with chrome valve covers. Pretty paint. Slick, slick paint. I love the color. Sorry, I got a few little leaves in there. These are just good looking cars, man. And they and they drive great. Factory dual chrome mirrors, you can nitpick those. Door handles have definitely, definitely
definitely been replaced. You can see it's got all new door rubbers. New carpet, new sill plates. But I believe this interior is original. And other than a little repair spot right there, I didn't see a whole lot you can pick at. Little interior lights work, factory sports steering wheel. It's showing 40,493. He he doesn't know the you know how many miles are on the resto. I'm sure assuming that's 140 there that's on the car. Um, factory tack and gauge car. Look how nice those are though. That's all the original dash. He's put some aftermarket gauges underneath. Factory AM radio. The original owner's manual's in the trunk. Um, it has an, a stainless, three inch uh, stainless X pipe uh, MagnaFlow dual exhaust system that sounds excellent. Uh, Tim Bolt, he says factory 292, which makes sense because the car is a factory air car. Uh, Posi rear end. It's got Hotchkiss uh, rear trailings on it, Hotchkiss rear sway bar. The car drives phenomenal. Um, spares in there. It's got um, this is an aftermarket jack. This is all the paperwork on this car. So, like I say, it's got it's been documented by the Sloan Museum. There's your receipts, and then you go all the way to the back, and there's your original build sheet for the car, which is pretty doggone cool. But he's had the car since two, uh, 2013. Said it's a great car, um, had a lot of fun with it, and now he's out hunting for another. It's nice and clean underneath, we got a beautiful exhaust, We've got a great sound. Just look how much nicer a Buick is than the Chevrolet. I mean, they're just nicer cars. Those gauges are just nice and clean. Like I say, just a good, good car. Yeah, new door handles. That looks like a new mirror to me. Choke works. You can see it's idling up right now. You just kick the air on. Air works. That choke will kick down too, guys, once it warms up. We just literally fired it up and pulled it out here. That just runs good. He's, he's actually got the AC on these switches over here. The heat is on this factory ones. Tack works. All, um, fuel gauge. Um, I think he's got his uh, temp. Yeah, temp and oil pressure is down there. You can see it's old. It's good oil pressure. Oh yeah, LED lighting. These are cool. Backup lights work. You can hear that nasty little cam. Once it warms up, that idle will kick down too. The radio does come on. You probably won't get a station up against the building. Oh, there you go. It works. Yep. Again, make sure you keep track of our inventory, guys. You can do that at southernmotors.com. Uh, another way to keep in touch with us is through our Instagram and our Facebook page. Definitely subscribe to our YouTube page. You can do that by clicking the little button there at the bottom. That way you get a notification every time I post. 
every time I post a new video. Have a great day, guys.